hi everyone in this video i'll explain you how to categorize leads based on the department and after that how you can add how you can assign or restrict a user based on this department so first of all what you'll have to do is the standard lead talk type doesn't have a department in it so you'll have to go to customize and then you'll have to add a department field over here like i have added and also have linked it to a department doc type so you can see if i go and if i select on new and you can see that there is a department field and within it you you'll see there are various department now apart from that now let's say that you are an admin and you have a user so you want a certain user to only deal with the, a lead of a specific department so how can you achieve this first of all you'll go to a user list now this is my admin view and this is the another one that is you can see i'm in the incognito browser and this is the user view so if a user go to lead you'll see they have all access to all of these different leads and over here also these are the leads present now let's go into this one and we can have a look now this is marketing and all of these are different different let's go this into this one okay this is also marketing and let's go to this one now this is sales so let's say you want to restrict this user to only to the sales department now how you'll do it you'll go to user list and you'll go into that user the username is Sanya okay and over here you'll go to permissions and set user permission and we'll create a new permission all right and we'll select a department so I'm selecting this one department and for value uh, let's say okay sales we are allowing sales my part all right so let's go back to lead again now these are all the leads and now what i'll do is i'll refresh on this uh, user view so let's refresh and then you will see that only those lead will stay which have a department as uh, marketing sales sales department i'm sorry not marketing okay so these are all now let's have a look into it now this is having sales now this is also having a sales department so that's how it is i hope you understood how you can add a department and how you can categorize a user based on this. So thank you so much for watching.